everyone, I'm Sophie and this is another quick vlog about brushes this time as you can see. So I just wanted to have a quick chat about oil painting brushes uh, because I hear many students talk about oil painting brushes uh, and they often think that you can only use brushes that are intended for oil painting. So if you go to an art material store or an online art material store, you can search for brushes by medium. So you can find acrylic brushes, watercolour brushes and oil brushes. And of course, brushes made for oil painting are the most suitable for oil painting. There is no doubt about that. So most of the brushes suitable for oil painting are bristle brushes. So, so these are brushes like this. They're really stiff. The hairs don't break very easily or very quickly. And they're really suitable for a bit rougher work. You can you really scrub the paint onto the canvas with these. You can scumble and you, you don't have to be as careful. And these brushes are also very good when you've got a more textured rough canvas. Um, because they, the hairs can take that quite easily. So I use these brushes usually for my underpainting stage when I'm really scrubbing on the paint um, quite roughly because I don't use a medium so I need to give it a bit more push and a bit more welly to get the, the canvas coloured. So bristle brushes are super suitable for oil painting and that is also how you will find them categorised in art material stores. But of course there are also synthetic brushes. Now I, for example, I like um, these brushes from Jackson's a lot. They are synthetic brushes and um, they are much softer than the bristle brushes. Now I think they are advertised as brushes for acrylic paint but they are super useful for oil paint as well. You can already feel in these synthetic brushes that the hairs are much softer and so obviously you will make much softer brush strokes with them as well. So the brush strokes will have a little bit less um, expressiveness and texture to them and you can make much smoother effects with them and you can layer over, over um, each other with the paint and you can blend a little bit more. So I use these brushes quite a lot in the subsequent stages so after the underpainting stage and I often use very small ones as well like these to create really small and fine detail and I find most synthetic brushes are excellent for oil paint. Now the last ones I want to talk about are the watercolour brushes. Now obviously these brushes are much more delicate than oil painting brushes because with watercolour you don't really scrub and push really hard and your stroke is much more gentle. Also watercolour brushes are not exposed to solvents or anything like that. You know, they don't need to be hard wearing and as long lasting as oil painting brushes. But that does not mean you cannot use them for oil painting. Obviously they perform best when you use them with watercolour. But for example, I love these small watercolour brushes. Um, like they used to be sable brushes. Now there's often synthetic versions of them and these brushes are perfect for small detail, for fine smooth work, for line work etc. Now here are some smaller brushes um, that I think all are advertised as watercolour brushes and I use all of them for the final stages in my oil paintings for fine detail, um, smooth line work but also to create a smooth texture in skin tones or in, in fabrics or anything like that. If you use them on a, a textured rough canvas, they will wear out in no time. So if you use them for oil painting or acrylic painting, you should really use them on very smooth canvas so they don't wear out too much. They just can't take as much punishment as oil painting bristle brushes. These brushes are delicate and you need to treat them as such. But just because it says it's a watercolour brush does not mean you cannot use that for oil painting. So I just wanted to make that clear that if you are into oil painting and you're not sure what brushes to choose, the world is your oyster. You can choose any of the brushes you find in an art material store. 
Obviously, some brushes are more suitable for some things and other brushes are more suitable for other things. So keep an eye on that. But they are all suitable for oil painting. So whether it's the rough and ready bristle brushes that oil painters traditionally use or whether it's a more of a synthetic brush with, with, with which you can make much smoother marks or you're going to go for watercolour sable type brushes they are all great to work with oil painting they just do different things so i hope that helps um, if you got any questions or you want to share your favorite brush please let me know in the comments thanks and happy painting mm -hmm.